Hello and welcome to Dave Supercars and to a very dusty Maserati Gran Turismo. First time owning a dark car and it's impossible to keep it clean, especially in Dubai, just covered in dust all the time. But that's not why you called. There's a major problem with the Gran Turismo and I'm going to show you what it is. These wheels stick in way too much. Those fenders, they just come out uh, way too far it just doesn't look right at all i mean look at that angle it is just terrible so i'm going to fix that by putting in some wheel spacers i mean it's just not right yeah so those wheels need to come out more and we're going to do that by installing some wheel spacers i got so Let's go inside and I will show you the wheel spacers I got. Then we'll go to a garage, get them fitted. I could do it myself, but bring to a garage. They'll have it done in 10 minutes where it would take me all day. So uh, join me inside and I'll show you the wheel spacers. Okay, so these are the wheel spacers I got um, overnight parts from Japan. Uh, they are blocks wheel spacers. I actually got them from Hong Kong, but uh, they got 10 year warranty. They've been fully tested apparently, meant to be very good from all the reviews I've done. And uh, they're black to go with the dark wheels I have and the dark car, so they don't stand out when you look at it. And yeah, it uh, should be good. I'll show you uh, inside. So I went for 22 mil at the front and 25 mil for the rears, because uh, looking at the forums, that's what uh, the most popular choice is for various reasons. So I decided to go with the flow and the majority, and that's what I went for. I was tempted to go 25-25 or even 25-30, but I thought I'd just be that little bit conservative and go with the vast majority of people. So that's what I went for, 22-25 at the rear. Um, so you, again, you take out these, they're screwed in here, and when you fit them, just put the screw in here into the existing hub, and then, use the studs that are on the car already on the alloy. You fit the alloy over that and you tighten it into here. So that's all it is. Um, very simple process, just take off the existing wheels, um, give it a bit of a clean and uh, make sure you tighten them to the recommended uh, torquing guidelines. Um, you also need around six and a half turns per uh, stud to make sure that it's uh, all secure yeah so six and a half turns and make sure that it's uh, around 133 pounds of torque or something is recommended so um we'll get those fitted and let's see the results i think it's going to make a huge difference to it so i'll go get that done and i'll show you what it's like when i return see you then wheels. Spacers definitely make a difference. Hundred percent. 